Hey guys, it's me Rila. Welcome back to Sand Rainbows. Today we are going to do a sunset painting and it's going to turn out great. So let's get started. So we will need black, primer red, scarlet, orange, medium yellow, light yellow, a pencil and a tissue. So let's get started by taking the primer red and just doing the bottom, but we'll do a small layer of this. So we'll do a small layer of the red. And yeah. And I'm gonna add some more of the red on the top. I think that wasn't enough. So yeah, that's good, that's good. Now I'm going to use the scarlet to help um, blend the orange and the red in. So the scarlet will be only a thin layer, a very thin layer, a very thin layer. So yeah, that's it. Nextly we're going to add orange and the scarlet will help the red and orange blend together. It'll help them and it'll become more of a beautiful painting. So if you don't have scarlet, that's okay. You can always um, mix the colors together with the tissue. So, but if you had scarlet, that's better. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna use this paper and then add a little layer of yellow on top of the orange, but then I'll do the orange back on top. So still, it's not um, fit to do the... We're not gonna do the yellow yet. Now we're gonna do this nextly. I'm gonna put some more of the yellow on top of this thing. The orange, sorry. So, yeah. I'm just gonna use then two times only we're gonna do this two times only so we did it over there and over here now i'm gonna use the yellow now it's time for the yellow layer. so i'm using medium yellow here i forgot to mention that so i'm using medium yellow here mm -hmm. and now we will just um use now I'll just use my finger to do some and then I'll add orange on the middle of that. Now I'm going to use light yellow but then do the medium yellow on top of it again just to blend that and just add some texture. And then I'm going to use light yellow so it's time for the light yellow layer. So yeah. After that, don't remove the masking tape yet, we're not done. Now we are going to just add some finishing touches and then I'm going to use the tissue to blend everything in. I'll add some finishing touches then use the tissue to blend everything in. So I'll mention the colors again, will be black, primary red, scarlet, orange, medium yellow and light yellow. Now I'm going to use the tissue to blend everything in and especially the corners because every time the corner always has um, a lot of white spaces. Always remember that you guys, always don't forget to use the corners. So I'm just going to use my finger a bit, just a bit and then do the tissue again. Nextly, I'm gonna, um, so one at a time, you guys. So firstly, I did red and scarlet. I mixed the red and the scarlet. Nextly, I mixed the scarlet and the orange. Then I'm gonna mix the, merge the orange and the yellow. So yeah, like that. Nextly, I am gonna do the yellow and then mm -hmm, I'm just gonna do the yellow and then I'm just gonna shade in the yellow and then shade. Now I'm gonna try to add some finishing touches over here on the um, 
orange and the corners a bit, so I see some white spaces. That's why. I'm just gonna add some finishing touches, but then I'm gonna do the light yellow now. So yeah, that's good. That's great. Now I'm just gonna flip this thing. I'm gonna flip the pad. Or you can just, um, if you don't want to flip the pad, you can just, uh, you know, start at the top. Nextly, I am gonna use my pencil to draw a mountain. So yeah. Now I'm gonna do the borders of the mountain with black first, and then color it in. So yeah, I'm just gonna color this in. I'm gonna color this in, and then we're gonna do the hue with white and gray. I forgot to mention those two colors before, I'm sorry about that, but let's just um, start with the black. So I'm just going to do the black. Also, while I do the black, I just wanted to say I have another oil pistol video. If you want, go check it out. So yeah, I'm just going to finish the black up. I'm going to finish the black up. And then we're gonna add hue with the white and gray. So we're gonna add some hue. I forgot to mention these two colors before. I'm sorry about that. But I'm doing this to make um, this more realistic, you know? To make the mountain more realistic. Just I'm adding the hue to make it more realistic. And we can use either white or we can use either only gray or we can use either both so we can use white only white or only gray or we can just use both so mm -hmm. I'm just gonna add some cue on the outline of the mountain with gray at first but then I'm gonna but then I'll add the um, white on wherever we add the splotches of gray so that will be good that'll be good now as you can see when i added the hue it'll look more realistic and after removing the masking tape this is our final picture bye